Hello, everyone, and welcome to episode one of our Sunday Stretches mini series. Today, we're going to start you off with all about how to make your workstation ergonomically correct. Thank you, Gretchen, for being our model. So, tomorrow morning, grab your coffee, grab your tea, and grab your bottle of water and take a seat at your workstation. A few things to avoid to start. We're not going to want you sitting on your bed. We don't want you sitting on the couch or the floor. Grab a nice hard chair to sit in. As Gretchen takes a seat, Here's what we're looking for. Her seat is adjusted so the hips are higher than her knees at a minimum of about 90 degrees. Her back is flush against the back of the seat. If you can't get flush, you can use a pillow or a blanket or a cushion to help adjust it. And as you can see, her feet are rested comfortably on the floor. If unable again, use a box, some yoga blocks, or maybe some books. She has moved her chair forward so that her stomach is resting just in front of her desk. She places both forearms on the table so that they are parallel to the floor. As you can see, she is sitting with good posture. Her shoulders are up, back, and down, and her hands, wrists, and forearms rest naturally on her keyboard and mouse. So Gretchen, how's it feel? You feeling any straining or discomfort? This feels great, Joe. I feel like I could sit here for 20 or 30 minutes. Gretchen has done a great job. She has set her computer screen just beyond her reach at eye level, directly in her line of vision. She also has everything she might need within a comfortable distance. For laptops, you can use a stand or something to prop up the screen at eye level. She's maintaining great posture and her monitor is a foot and a half to two feet or just over an arm's length away. So she's not leaning forward or squinting to read her screen. Gretchen, anything to add? Yeah, just remember to take a break. Every 20 to 30 minutes, be sure to focus your eyes on something five to 10 feet away. Blink, you can even get up and walk around or stretch, roll your neck and shoulders, just rest. Well, I guess we all get to take a break now. Enjoy your new workstations and have a great week. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to your athletic trainer. And we'll see you back here next week where we go over upper extremity stretches.